Hello there, uh, Breezy. I just came to your little public service here. Since in the last episode, we're lost with swimming cap. Let's go back. I want a respiration. Oh. Looks like I'm not allowed to open chests. I'll be back. Alright, can I open chests? Yes! So I'll have a respiration 3D book. I'll have an aqua affinity book. I'll have an unbreaking 3D book. Uh, and protection, I think, is the only other one I'm after. And I may as well be nice. Take two protection threes instead of the protection four there. The guy only sells protection three books there. I'll use a bit of my own XP to get that up to protection four. And I do believe that's my swimming cap back. Aqua affinity, unbreaking, respiration, protection. I don't think there was anything else for my swimming cap. Now we want to go mending. And we want one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten mending books. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. There we go. We've got the 10 mending books. So that should be the swimming cap rebuild. And then the rest of this mending is for, you know, like choppy boy and shooty boy. I don't think you could put mending on an infinity bow. Alright, so I'm after thorns 3, and cleaving, and swift sneak. Thorns. I don't think there's any thorns here. There should be a shortness. Ah. Sharpness. So I'll take one sharpness. A uh, looting. Oh, there's no looting. Hey, here. Yeah, what up, Sam? Any chance I could um, get you to procure me a looting three book, please? The only one I don't have. <laughs> it's oh, if if he's not cheap, don't worry about it. If he's thirty one for you, then. No, no, no. He if they're in there, it's cheap. It's just like the last dude I got in there. Like I just never. Didn't get around trading him. Oh, he was happy. There's a book. I appreciate the looting three book. That's a vanishing bro. I'm seeing if you got any thorns knocking about. He liked thorns. Are, are, are these going to waste, these lanterns? Yeah. Oh, I love them. <laughs> yeah, I was going Why to thorns up my armor, but uh, I, I'm not sure how I got enough emeralds to pay you just yet. How many do you want? Uh, four? Yeah, one free trauma piece. I think that's all you can do. So I'll owe you a stack of, uh, stack of emeralds. Yeah, thorns is like a little cherry on top. Imagine if when that wither was, was slapping us and it had thorns on, I'd just be slapping it back. If it had thorns on, your arm would be all gone, because it used up way more durability. Oh, does it? Okay then. Uh, in that case, I'll just keep the two thorns books I have and owe you half a stack for now. <laughs> Oh, you don't want any more when not some. You don't need to own anything. Nah, nah, go on, go on, go on. Nah, I'll, t I'll take the phone, I'll have like a prickly set or something like that. And I lost my diamond do rag. No, oh, not the diamond do rag. I don't believe it. I'll, I'll use all of my stuff here, so protection 3, protection 3, that's me protection 4. And then it's just a case of adding these on. I don't think I can get cheaper than 2. Yeah, 6. So we'll do that one. We've got 7 levels left. Do an unbreaking and a protection. And chamber level four. Chamber level five. Alright. Then can I do a mending on one of these? Oh yeah, level three. That's all me. That's all me levels. So that's at 13 or 16. And then I desperately need to get some mending on these as well. I think I'll do that off camera with all my new lanterns that I've got placed. And I've I've done I've done a bit of the dick here on camera. So I started the dicking. But uh what I'm going to do now is just... Well, I'm just going to finish Dick. I'm going to finish the Dick by myself. You can see a bit of what I'm going for yeah, with the Dick. But for now, welcome to the Skeleton Zone. I'm just here repairing my pickaxe. My little silky boy. So we can go out on an adventure. Now we're fully repaired, look at that. I've got Zoomy Boy back in the offhand for a bit of Zoomy action. A bit of zoom in on the torch. But before we go on our adventure, we have to put this brush in this book together to make the sweepy boy there we are the sweepy boy needs to come with us where we're going you know what while i'm here may as well repair the sweepy boy yeah well may as well repair the scoopy boy as well <laughs> i'll put this back 
I'll meet you back at the house. Are we peeps? I've mostly finished me digging here. Got it all the way around the side. And then I would show you that side as well, but I have some temporary guards up. Temporary guards on the stairs all the way around there. Into a new pen. This is going to be the new animal pasture here. But we have to do a cattle run first. So uh, I guess we're going to see how that goes. Are you ready dogs? You ready cows? Are you ready for the cattle run? We're going to have to take the bells down for the cattle run. I hope you are ready for this. It's going to be wild, I tell you. Wild. We go... One, two, three, four! Be free, cows and sheep. And one pig. And then what I want you to do is make your way over here. Into that pen, if you wouldn't mind. And I will bring something to help you along with that. What do I need? A carrot. A carrot will come in very handy. And I also need some wheat. Do I have any wheat? Or did I turn it all into hay bales? Ah, there's some wheat. Right. El Pico. Nah, I'm joking. Hey, sheep and cows. Sheep and cows. Follow me, sheep and cows. All the sheep and cows. Follow your boy Migly. He's got the wheat. Alright, let's go down here. Let's go. In here. And yeah, fair enough. I thought that drop might be a bit much. So, I'm going to go ahead and... There you are. Now you can fall down without dying. Alright, everybody in. Everybody over here. Wave the wheat about. Yep, all the way over here. Into this side of the pen. See, look, I've got, I've got the lure. I can lure them into this side of the pen and then switch away and run away and go, ha ha ha, noobs. Close that. Close the other two. And then I go back for the pig. And I just have to quickly whoop, and get the pig. Oh, and a ship. So we've got a pig and a ship. Did the pig escape? Oh, the pig probably escaped under there. I didn't realise I'd left a gap there. Uh, pig? Piggy? Where'd the pig go? Did the pig fall on you? No. Where's the pig? Pig? Pig! I swear I had a pig. Pretty confident I had a pig. I'm pretty confident I had a sheep as well. Where did that sheep just go? Oh, there you are. Alright, sheep, let's go. Sheep. Sheep, look at this. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, let's go. Let's go, sheep. Be smarter than me. Good sheep. Alright, come on in. That'll do. That'll do. So is the pig already in there or something? Where did the pig go? Yeah, I'm pretty sure the pig's not in here. I'm pretty sure the pig got out. Because of that gap there. The pig got out, and then got out, got out. Alright. Carrot. Come on, pig. No, 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 no. no. <sighs> I have rescued two cows from down there. Purposely. Hey, pig. You want carrot? Come on. Carrot time. Up the stairs. Carrot. Alright. Carrot! Hey, let's go, piggy. Alright, 
And you're just going to go ahead and fall off here. Yep. Yeah. Good piggy. You know what? Have a carrot. I may as well breed some of you while I'm out here as well. There you are. Come on, everybody breed. Look at the little bobby shape. Where's the bob? Oh, where's it? look at the little bobby moo in the bobby shape. Yeah, if only there was another cow. I'd feed it a carrot. Ah, that, that, that pig deserved that carrot for escaping. Pig! Second pig, second pig. Hey pig, you like carrot? Yeah, you do. Let's go. Let's go, pig. Right, you can do it. Oh, that pig was clever as well. Yeah, clever pig. Come on, pig. Let's go. Alright. Make a new pig. <gasps> you alright there, mate? You look a bit... Uh... Hey, he's alright. Oh, look at the little piggy. Got the little pig, the little ship, and the little cow. Prop a little farm here on Miggly's farm. Oh, we can take down these... Uh... These cattle run borders. Don't need these up anymore. Blah, 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 blah. Lovely. And there was a torture. Moo. How are you liking me, Dick? The mangrove roots aren't necessarily there permanently, but just using them as a little foundation around, around the dick. And then over here, same dealio. Yeah, I'm thinking about doing something along the back here. So we've got a little dicking in the back. Otherwise we've got plenty of dicking in the front here. And pattern wise, we have mangrove wood for general dicking. And then we have a bit of special strip dicking above the acacia wood. With some lovely little cherry slabs. As you do, you know. As you do. So yeah, I just did a pattern from the outside in, and yeah, I think it looks alright. It's nothing crazy, nothing special, but I think it looks nice. It's a bit different, you know. Maybe when I've got an elite row, we can fly around, get that uh, that bird's eye view, that drone angle of low shed estate and form. <laughs> Oh yeah, I'm gonna crack on. And yeah, un underneath here, I'm, I'm gonna have a little area, maybe a little farming area or something underneath in the basement. Get on! I don't know if you've seen this. Old mate's blocking the, the doorway. It looks like he is anyway, I think it might be further down here. Yeah. But the wood there, the wood from the corner of the house, it goes underground and it's bedded all the way down to the rock there. It's a proper foundational bit of wood. Is that? That bit of wood there. It goes all the way down. Well, there's Lou Sherb Estate and Farm. Put the door back on. There we are. Without any need for the gates. Beautiful. Bye!